you look really closely, you can see the black hole over there. Anyways, let's go. A mirror of the signal on Habitat 7. Possible atmospheric manipulation. I just had to is that possible? We'll find out. I if like it is like Habitat 7, it's... no doubt we'll run into the cat. Yes, please. I don't know how to use these. I'm just looking, okay? Suiting up. Ready, Freddy? Hope we're all that ready. Callo, all right? Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multisensory neural collation. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board. Spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this pass than the Nexus has had in months. What? You said a lot of people have their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. I can't blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Oh, sorry. I'm still you okay? feeling Dad's loss. I'm up for this adventure! This is exactly why we came. A new galaxy? A new ship? I can't wait to get both a little dirty. Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted a Pathfinder to see that. Core is hot. Shields holding, adjusting entry. We got this, right? There. Set us down at this nav point. Suffers deadly storms that are contaminated by radiation from the scourge. EO's deployment was incomplete due to environmental hazards and ultimately hostile encounters. Plus, no Pathfinder. If EOS is like Habitat 7, that signal we scanned must be connected with the atmosphere. The door's getting emergency power, but it's code locked. Site 1 issued individual security codes. Each outpost self organizes and sets its own protocol. Oh, come on. Just say we can't open it without codes. We can't open it without codes. They must have known these wouldn't last in these conditions. But they didn't have a Pathfinder. They do now. We'll make Eos home. How? This looks like a broken building sideways, but somehow I guess he managed to make a sideways building turn into a regular old house. Well, it's probably this. Well, it has to be the snoops, Pete. Wait. I think I accidentally said noobs papers. Like, noobs are flying all over the place. <laughs> okay. What's this? Got a code lock key. That should help get us in. Thanks. I want to switch out my buddies.
Well, stick with them anyways. I'm not mean to you. Not even you with the curly hair. But he should. I got a partial log, but I can't turn on the antenna. Something's blocking the power. A remote lock is active. The interference originates from a nearby power relay tower. So we're not the only ones interested in what happened here. Let's check out this relay tower. Is it cool that there's a sunset in the desert? I mean, in Red Dead Redemption, that would be awesome, but... This don't look like Texas. Look at this place. It's a wasteland. The radiation in Eos' atmosphere makes it difficult to cultivate life. Radiation? Our suits protect against that, right? Site 1 contains shield masts to dampen the brunt of contamination. But if we went outside Site 1's perimeter? That would not be advised. So if our suits protect us, then why are you two not wearing helmets? Maybe I should take off my own helmet if you guys don't need helmets. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can still breathe in this planet. Right? I hope you guys trust me. Hey, look, it's water. It can't go in it. Structure up ahead. Sam? It fits the profile of a power relay station, Pathfinder. Right. We get it running, maybe buildings get power. And we can hunt. It's inoperable, Pathfinder. Too long in this environment without power. We didn't expect this kind of environment. Who could? I expect this kind of environment. It's a desert. What do you expect? <laughs> Deserts make everything destroyed. My Guess that shit wasn't place. Ket then. They don't knock. There are people here? We thought everyone left was gone. Of course you did. Now shove off. Find your own salvage. This spot's taken. I'm here to hope. I'm not a salvager. I'm a pathfinder. We've come to fix all this. Call me Clancy. Pathfinder, huh? Like that changes much. The Nexus just can't let Eos go, can it? However much it fails down here. I'm tracking a signal that will help Eos. I only need power for the antenna. Look, I cut the power for a reason. The Ket are patrolling today. You turn the power relay back on, they'll know there's a juicy target alive down here. So I help more people than Spider-Man. Um, but Eos could be saved. Is it smarter to hide and hope? Or take a chance that might save this whole planet? I remember when people used to talk like that. Okay, I'll enable the generators out there. You want to poke the tiger, it's on you. Poke a tiger? Is a tiger? Expect trouble when we start the generators. Let's get through all these crumbles of rocky rocks. There's an error in the startup sequence. Oh. Manual input required. That Damn it. Explode? Please scan one of the pylons to determine a hackable input location. This analysis. Generator interface possible. Location marked. We're gonna scan everything. Can I scan you? Can I scan this whole entire ship? Can I scan the building? Really, Ryder? What was that, Scott? I mean, 
can't speak. <laughs> Do you guys see that house? Generator is active. Sam, a friend Clancy, was he part of the outpost team here? No, Pathfinder. According to Nexus records, he's stationed in the hangar bay. So he's what? Playing hooky? Or he's a part-time salvager. That's a way to get faster. Just to use your... Your jet. We've got company. Ha, 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 ha. 